said, what then should a business owner consider when deciding on selecting an attorney? First of all, I think it's important that the uh, business owner recognize it is a relationship. So anything that you would bring to any relationship or look for in a relationship, I think you need to bring with, when you're selecting an attorney. And I think that's something that's often um, overlooked because you think you are just going for advice. But in terms of the types of lawyer you might look for, uh, you would want to find somebody that has experience or at least an interest in the area that you as the business owner are interested in. Someone that you feel is able to answer your questions. Um, I would look for someone who either my friends or colleagues or people I respect have relationships with or experience with um, and that they might recommend. Um, I am a proponent of interviewing attorneys. Um, that seems to go hand in hand with developing a relationship. You can't do that over the phone. Exactly. Um, it's always best to have a face-to-face -face meeting and, and just see how you uh, communicate with each other. You mentioned something else that I'd like to explore a little more. Um, you said the type of experience that the uh, lawyer might have. For example, can a lawyer who is experienced with large, large co corporations be as effective for small businesses or vice versa? I absolutely think so. Um, again, that would be something you might want to look at and ask about. Um, I don't think there's any one factor that would preclude a lawyer from being effective, but what you need to explore is um, do they have the experience that is relevant to what you want. I should not be the, the sole lawyer considered for, say, a family law matter. That's not my background. However, in talking to me, you might find that I had something to offer to your situation that might be relevant. Mm -hmm. But for the, the most part, you want somebody with the experience that you are looking for.